All right, so uh, I guess last week I bought on eBay a uh, EPS, and Sonic EPS, um, with the, uh, knowing that it didn't work, um, you know, the, that it had a bad power supply. Um, but, you know, it was cheap, so I picked it up. And the reason I picked it up is because right now I'm using a TS-10 to, uh, as a dedicated controller for the Deckard stream, um, you know, for the poly after touch. Uh, the TS-10 is far too fine an instrument to be, you know, sacrificed for something like that. So I figured if I could buy another cheap end Sonic with Poly AT, then, um, then, you know, I'd be ahead of the game and then TS-10 could go back to, you know, being both, you know, it's basically both a kick-ass waves, uh, wavetable keyboard and as well as, you know, sample player because it plays all the ASR-10 and Akai discs. So, um... So anywho, so let's check it out. I pulled the main fuse, um, hoping I would get lucky, but now nah, that wasn't it. So um, there's five more fuses here that I have to check out. So this one, good, good, good. And there we go. And okay, so, so these last two are bad. Now, I'll probably end up Pulling the whole power supply board um, and checking the, the caps as well, but uh, because if these fuses blew, they blew for a reason. You know what I mean? So there's you know there's no guarantee that I could just pop new fuses in here and and it's, everything's going to be happy and it's all going to work. So I mean the, the fuses blew for a reason. So anyway, let me get some fuses and then uh, we'll see what happens. All right, so I've uh, I've replaced the two fuses in here. Um, from an actual spare power supply from a TS-10. Now, these are supposed to be four amp fuses. Um, the TS-10 uses three amp, but, um, so I'm totally expecting them to blow, but I have more on order, um, and it's not gonna hurt anything, so. Uh, so let's do this. Let's find a power cord. This is always the fun part. We just we just have no idea whether it's going to blow up or not. Oh, sorry, excuse the, excuse me here for the camera for a second. Let's get to the uh, power supply. Get the plug in. Okay, I'm trying to leave the lid open while I do this. So hopefully, so this this may actually turn out to be an example of what not to do, um, which I'm fully expecting. So, all right, there's the switch. And I don't know if you just saw that spark, but they both just blew immediately. So there's a short in there somewhere. Um, I'm gonna have to pull the board. Um, yeah, so, some in here short, and I don't think I even see where it is. So, all right, well, we'll get to it. Oh, well. <laughs> 